Republican presidential candidate Vivek Ramaswamy thinks he has a plan for peace in Ukraine, but it'll require significant diplomatic concessions from us to Russia. Ramaswamy believes that he can freeze the conflict in Ukraine in its current place in exchange for Russian guarantees that it would dissolve its military relationship with Beijing. How? I don't know. Neither does the candidate based on his extremely rudimentary understanding of both this conflict and other frozen conflicts in the former Soviet space, which Russia ignites, pauses, and then subsequently reignites when it thinks it can benefit from more fighting. The idea that we could convince Russia to abide by, much less agree to, a diplomatic agreement that severs relations with its primary sponsor in Beijing and also the chief purchaser of its petroleum products is profoundly naive. The withdrawal of U.S. support for Ukraine wouldn't stop the fighting. It would most likely contribute to more fighting, which would get closer, in fact, to NATO's borders and threaten NATO members. Ramaswamy would be better off deferring to the experts who actually understand the region before he starts talking about peace plans that make no sense.